and welcome to the session. Let us discuss the following question. The question says, find the number of four digit numbers that can be formed using the digits 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 if no digit is repeated. How many of this will be even? Before solving this question, we should first be well versed with theorem 1. Theorem 1 states that the number of permutations of n different objects taken r at a time and the objects do not repeat is NPR, where N is the number of different objects, R is the number of objects taken at a time, and this NPR is equal to N factorial upon N minus R factorial. We will use this theorem as key idea to solve this question. Let's now begin with the solution. Given five digits are one, two, three, four, and five. We have to find number of four digit numbers that can be formed by using these digits if no digit is repeated. And also we have to find number of even four digit numbers. You should know that here order of digits matters. as 1, 2, 3, 4 and 4, 3, 2, 1 are different numbers. Therefore, total number of four digit numbers formed with digits one, two, three, four, and five. When no digit is repeated, is equal to number of permutations of five different digits. taken four at a time. By theorem one, we 
We know that number of permutations of n different objects taken r at a time and the objects do not repeat is npr. Now here n different objects are 5 different digits and r is 4 and also the digits do not repeat. So by using theorem 1, number of permutations of 5 different digits taken 4 at a time is equal to 5PR. And as NPR is equal to N factorial upon N minus R factorial, therefore 5PR is equal to 5 factorial upon 5 minus 4 factorial. And this is equal to 5 factorial upon 1 factorial. Now 5 factorial is equal to 5 into 4 into 3 into 2 into 1 factorial. So we have 5 into 4 into 3 into 2 into 1 factorial upon 1 factorial. Cancelling one factorial from both numerator and denominator, we are left with 5 into 4 into 3 into 2 and this is equal to 120. So total number of four digit numbers that can be formed using the digits 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 when no digit is repeated is 120. Now we have to find number of even numbers from this four digit numbers. We know that unit place of even numbers is even. Now the five digits given to us are 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. Out of these five digits only two that is 2 and 4 are even. So that means we have only two options for filling the unit space. If we fix 2 at the unit space, then the number of four digit numbers Ending with 2 is equal to permutations of remaining four different digits. Taken three at a time. By theorem one, we know that number of permutations of n different objects taken r at a time and the objects do not repeat as npr. Here, n different objects are four different digits and r is three. So by using theorem 1, permutations of remaining four different digits taken three at a time is 4P3. We know that NPR is equal to N factorial upon N minus R factorial. Here N is 4 and R is 3. So 4P3 is equal to 4 factorial upon 4 minus 3 factorial and this is equal to 4 factorial upon 1 factorial and this is equal to 4 into 3 into 2 into 1 factorial upon 1 factorial. We can cancel 1 factorial from both numerator and denominator. So we are left with 4 into 3 into 2 and this is equal to 24. Similarly, when we fix 4 
at the unit space then number of four digit numbers ending with four is equal to number of permutations of remaining four different digits taken three at a time that is 4p3 and on simplifying 4p3 we get 24 therefore required number of four digit even numbers is equal to 24 plus 24 and this is equal to 48. Hence our required answer is 120 and 48. This completes the session. Bye and take care.